Guys, welcome to the second installment of this video showing you actual real proof that Genesect and Arceus are coming to the <laughs> I know you guys had a problem with me how I pronounce Arceus, okay? Ar Arceus, Arceus, I got all sorts of different things in the description, guys. Honestly, it doesn't matter, but anyway, you know which Pokemon I'm talking about, and they're coming in one of the DLCs. Now, last time we did a video, like two days ago, or yeah, a day ago, that showed you guys video evidence of what I was talking about, which was this. It was the move Technoblast for Genesect, and it was the move Judgment for Arceus. We also had Darkrai in there with Dark Void, and we had V Create for Victini, which this Victini hacked was doing in the game. It was actually fully animated move, which is in the game, which you cannot get at the moment, which is a dead giveaway, guys. They put in work for this animation in the game with the specific plan to release a Pokemon that's going to learn it, and that is either going to be Victini coming in the DLC or could also possibly be a Rayquaza, however, that's much less likely because Rayquaza learned this with a very special specific event. It's an event move for him. It's much more likely that the Pokemon that learns it normally is going to be Victini, is going to be added to the game. However, guys, I'm here to show you new evidence, hardcore evidence, that Arceus and Genesec are coming to the game. So just a quick shout out is going to go to KingPhenom413 over on Twitch. Here is his URL. It's also pinned in the, the comments right down below. If you want to go ahead and give him a, a look up, it's probably well worth your time. Thank you for the raid, King Phenom. Before I forget, guys, I want to give a little shout out to Sakaiath over on Discord as well for getting me in contact with King. So that's right, we're going to go ahead and do a special raid because we're going to get some items that are in the game, programmed and fully usable and fully workable items that you cannot get normally that are actually in the game right now that prove the return of Arceus and Genesect. Alright, so we're in our special raid here with King on Twitch and we're going to go ahead and get the rewards. The only thing we're here for are the rewards. This is of course another Missing No Style raid. It's designed to be one hit and the rewards are what's special. So let's go ahead and grab those. So this is a Missing No, it's a full on Pikachu that's clearly not a shiny Pikachu. Cold Egg with the shiny effect, the shiny uh, sp spring bling, right? But it's not shiny Pikachu, so that's that's the clear sign of a missing note. We're gonna go ahead, we're not even gonna catch it, I already have mine, it's fine. What we're here for is the rewards. And these are those rewards, guys, these. Okay, we got the Genesect drives right here. We got four of them here, Dow's drives, shock drives, burn drives, and chill drives, 999 of them. And by the way, you need to pay attention to the really important point here, they have objects beside them. They have animated, uh, I suppose, icons for them. And that goes same for the Arceus plates right here. We got all the different Arceus plates, well, some of them, and they are fully functioning items in the game right now. That's a big difference compared to, like, say, the Mega Stones that we also have in the game. So now I need to tell you guys why this is so significant, why this is evidence. So right here, I'm showing you guys items that are not in the game. These are not programmed in the game right now. These are red, blue orb, Charizard, these are mega stones for all those different Pokemon. They are not in the game, okay? But they are in the data, and as far as these items go in the data is text data, okay? These are in the game as text data only. That's where these new items are very, very different. These are items that you can actually use in the game properly. These Arceus plates give you a bonus uh, one point two or 1.3 times power to the moves of the typing of these plates and they are they do work in the game these are fully functioning obviously we don't have genesect in the game yet but it's damn well sure as hell coming because this is way beyond text data this is not just text data right here this is programmed into the game fully available so many of you guys might still be hitting the x button for doubt but if you're if you're not following at this point guys we need to come and talk to talk to you about one more thing one more item that is in the game without hacks without special raids it's fully in the game for everybody to be able to obtain legitimately fully functioning and that is of course the pixie plate guys the pixie plate that is the fairy typing Arceus plate the only one that is available in the game at the moment and that is where we're going what we're watching right now is a video from gamer guru who, who's going to go get that plate and wherever it is I mean I, it's in this maze it's in this area but he's anyway he's gonna show you exactly
exactly where to find it. I thought I'd give you a bit of a run-up. It's actually not even a Pokeball item, but there it is. It's the Pixie Plate right there, guys. An item to be held by a Pokemon that's a stone tablet. It's the Fairy-type Arceus Plate, folks. Yes, you can get that in the game. You can get the all the plates in the game. You can get the Genesec things, but you don't have a real use for the Genesec drives, guys. That's these guys right here. They're specifically for Genesec. It changes Genesec's Techno Blast move, so it becomes Ice-type. If you guys remember, I just showed you the Genesec move is in the game. You can be hacked in. It's available. And V Create has like an animation. I don't know if the other ones have an animation on them yet. However, these have icons, so things are programmed into the game and they're ready. To be used. Obviously it's so important because it's different from the other items, the other items that are not programmed to the game beyond text data which are these because these have not been decided yet okay. I did cover these in data mine videos before. These have been found and they do indicate that the primordial guys are going to be coming. They do indicate that the megas are going to be coming in the future and there's pretty strong pretty good evidence pointing that direction. However it's not conclusive but these are these are very very strong evidence pointing towards Arceus coming back and Genesis coming back. So guys, that's going to be it for this short video, but it is definitely fascinating to see. It's really nice to be able to see that we're just getting items like this. Again, thank you to the guys who are hosting this raid and getting me in contact with the appropriate people. Thanks for hooking me up with this raid and we have these items to show to the world. I can't wait to use them. These are all fully functioning. If I want to get an extra boost on my electric type moves, I'm going to throw Zap Plate on a on an, uh, Pokemon. As a matter of fact, I do have Mind Plate on here and I can just go ahead and give that to my Mew right now because he doesn't have anything. And while he's holding it with the item and the icon right beside him right there and it, I'm, I have no doubts it works as well just like the same as the pixie plate that is in the game so guys that's it what do you make of that does it really add to the video I did last night and if not tell me why let me know in the comments I'd really appreciate it if you are new to my channel please consider subscribing because we come out with all the best hot stuff right here on this channel you know it you know it you guys who are already subbed, you guys already know. We need to get these other guys to get in on, on this uh, info as well. But anyway, I do appreciate you guys stopping by, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this. I'll see you guys around for the next video. Tomorrow, Pokemon news and a special announcement. See you then. Bye!